That's got to be the best pirate I've ever seen. So it would seem. But it would seem that as I possess a ship and you don't, you're the ones in need of rescuing. I'm not sure as I'm in the mood. I see my ship right there. Can't spot it. Must be a tiny little thing hiding somewhere behind the pearl. Love, that is a dinghy. My vessel is magnificent and fierce and huge-ish. Shoot him and cut out his tongue, then shoot his tongue. And trim that scraggly beard. If you were waiting for the opportune moment, that was it. Now, if you'd be so kind, I'd be much obliged if you dropped me off my ship. Ah, oh, Hector! It's been too long, hasn't it? I, il de muerte, remember. You shot me. No, I didn't. I made you, Captain? I'm just giving the bloody title away now. You know me. You want to know me. There'll be no knowing here. We've come for help and we're not leaving without it. I thought I knew you. Not so well as I had hoped. Close your eyes and pretend it's all a bad dream. That's how I get by. Full pardon. Commission is a privateer on behalf of England and the East India Trading Company. As if I could be bought for such a low price. You actually were telling the truth. I do that quite a lot. Your people are always surprised. You cheated. Pirate. Mr. Gibbs. Captain. You may throw my hat if you like. Aye, aye, Captain. Now <laughs> go and get it. <laughs> Why should I sail with any of you? Four of you have tried to kill me in the past. One of you succeeded. Pirate or not, this man saved my life. One good deed is not enough to redeem a man of a lifetime of wickedness. Though so it seems enough to condemn him. Did no one come to save me just because they missed me? I'm standing over there with him. You may kill me, but you may never insult me. Who am I? I'm Captain Jack Sparrow. Now, as long as you're just hanging there, pay attention. The only rules that really matter are these. What a man can do, and what a man can't do. If we don't have the key, we can't open whatever it is we don't have that it unlocks. So what purpose would be served in finding whatever need be unlocked, which we don't have, without first having found the key what unlocks it? So, we're going after this key? You're not making any sense at all. All right, then. I confess. It is my intention to commandeer one of these ships, pick up a crew in Tortuga, raid, pillage, plunder, and otherwise pilfer my Weasley black guts out. I said no lies. I think he's telling the truth. If he were telling the truth, he wouldn't have told us. Unless, of course, he knew you wouldn't believe the truth, even if he told it to you. I'll tell you, mate, if every town in the world were like this one, no man would ever feel unwanted. Scarlet! Not sure I deserve that. Giselle. Who was she? What? I may have deserved that. You're not a eunuch, are you? Kill a lamb. Lamb peaky peaky. Lamb meansy weensy. Lamb say say eunuchy. Simps dip. Hide the rum. Because you and I are alike. And there will come a moment when you have a chance to show it. To do the right thing. I love those moments. I like to wave at them as they pass by. Look what I got. I got a jar of dirt. I got a jar of dirt. And guess what's inside it? Take what you can. Give nothing back. The world used to be a bigger place. The world's still the same. It's just less in it. Alas, my children, this is the day you shall always remember as the day that you almost... Captain Jack Sparrow. You are without doubt the worst pirate I've ever heard of. But you have heard of me. 
Why is rum gone? One, because it is a vile drink that turns even the most respectable men into complete scoundrels. Two, that signal is over a thousand feet high. The entire Royal Navy is out looking for me. Do you really think that there is even the slightest chance that they won't see it? But why is the rum gone? Bring me that horizon. Really bad eggs. Drink up, me hearty Joe Ho. When you marooned me on that godforsaken spit of land, you forgot one very important thing, mate. I'm Captain Jack Sparrow. <laughs>